Today, we'll be discussing one of the greatest minds of our generation, a true scholar of society, the one and only Lucas Werner. Lucas is actually somebody who I've already covered on this channel already. Kind of. I briefly looked into some of his videos in a stream I did, although this was me stepping into something I was brand new to and making brief little comments on, which, fun fact, he also replied to. Don't think he really appreciated the stream though. Anyway, Lucas is a writer, singer, songwriter, a spokesperson for ageing men and a scientist talking about one of the most important things when it comes to humanity, and most importantly, its successful future. Well, if people follow his advice. So, let's talk about Lucas Werner, the scourge of Spokane. Lucas's main drive in life is women. He is really, really obsessed with women, specifically fornication. Despite this desperation, Lucas has a limit for who he will get down and dirty with. The main reason for Lucas's lack of sexual endeavours, except, well, his looks, lack of money, and lack of intelligence, is the fact that he will only sleep with girls from the age age of 18 to 30 year olds. This actually used to be much worse, with the age range before this being 16 to 30 year olds, although, because people kept telling him that this was bad, he actually had enough self-awareness to raise the age. However, that doesn't quite stop it from being creepy though, considering his age as he's in his late 30s to early 40s. Lucas's weird age thing that he has likely comes from his ex-girlfriend, Suzanne, a 50-year-old woman whom he was going out with when he was in his early 30s. However, this relationship doesn't seem to have ended too well, with him possibly attacking her in some way, as well as the fact that he stopped taking his medication soon after, as he has bipolar disorder, schizophrenia and diabetes, making him likely even worse than he already was. So, how does Lucas go about getting these younger women? Well, Lucas kind of goes in the movie bob route, talking about what children would most be desired for in the future. Lucas tries to persuade these younger women to sleep with him with his most vital possession, his telomerase. Telomerase are enzymes that repair telomeres, which are in chromosomes. Lucas constantly spouts about how important these telomerase are, and that the most successful way to breed would require a man of around his age to do it with a younger woman in his preferred age range, which is quite lucky, eh? This is obviously babble, and just a straight up ploy to try to convince women to have sex with him as he's desperate and used to make note of his dry spell, just like Cobra, although has since stopped. The other way Lucas goes about seducing women is through politics. Yes, I know, a great way to attract women. He's a real Casanova. Lucas's trick to getting women is through the politics of socialism. Back before, and in 2016, when Bernie Sanders was running for president, Lucas was a staunch supporter of him. However, how much of the support was due to political beliefs is hard to decipher, as Lucas mainly has this line of thinking in order to court females, as he believes all Gen Z women are socialist, highly left-wing people. If you haven't realised by now, Lucas is a rather creepy person, completely driven by women. However, I haven't even covered some of the creepier things that Lucas has spoken about yet, but I will now. In 2016, Lucas became infamous when he went to a Starbucks and saw a barista who quickly grabbed his easily attainable attention. Upon seeing her, he quickly jotted down a note and handed it to her with it stating, There's this chemical in my body, telomerase. All men past 35 automatically become ideal fathers and husbands. It leads offspring stronger DNA. It's been a year. It's been five years since I've had sex. Why do I feel this need to be inside you? Yeah, as a person, and in addition to this letter, not a great first impression. Neither is the fact that she was 16 years old either. Yeah, he was banned from the Starbucks and actually made it onto traditional media. 
More humorous and creepy things that have come from Lucas is from his Facebook profile. Seemingly unprompted, Lucas posted that he would rather be a father to a daughter than a son. When asked why he holds this choice, he states, princesses and hearing daddy, which just makes him seem so, so creepy. Before I finish this video off, I just want to briefly mention that Lucas has been catfished numerous times throughout his time on the internet. I think even more than Chris Chan, which is quite the accomplishment, I suppose. I will briefly mention one time in 2016 when somebody began catfishing Lucas under the name of Joy Baker, a 19 year old woman. Lucas quickly became enamoured and bought a bus ticket from Spokane, Washington to Idaho to visit. It's fair to say that he never met this Joy. Also during this time, he changed his relationship status to state that they were dating. In response, Joy stated, For the record, this is news to me. Truly a gentleman, although surprisingly not supreme. Lucas is a bit of a strange case. He hasn't really seemed to have been as active as he had been a few years ago, although I personally started following late, around January of this year. Lucas's final actions and videos on YouTube as of now had been videos of him eating food without any commentary or any actions from him, as well as community posts that you wouldn't be surprised to see posted from a teenager, because it is all sappy, stupid stuff. Sadly, Lucas has hidden or deleted his channel, and thus all of his videos are gone. Although, while it's not completely lost, they are in a state of limbo. A channel by the name of Wernology has the videos, and is currently uploading them as fast as possible to YouTube, which, to those who have not seen his videos, I urge you to watch some of them as they come out, as some of them are really gold. To end this video off, I will play some of these videos for you to enjoy. This is the British symbol for up yours. Uh, the age phobia is just naughty shit and you're a leftist. We've been through this a thousand thousand times. What are telomeres? Well, telomeres are the ends of a chromosome that shrink as a cell ages. In other words, the older you get, the less telomerase is on the end of the chromosome, and the telomeres shrink. Look at all the little face. I'm going to take a shower tomorrow morning, so. Yeah, like a pimple where my glasses slash my nose bridge. I want an adult hottie in my lap right now, under 26 right now, no frills, no excuse, big titties and intelligence. I don't care if she's a hood, rap, punk rock, or any kind of anything. As long as she's hot and here right now, on my 37-year-old dick right now, 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 right now. For five years of never having anything, as everybody else gets laid. The gray hair beers use the research on telomerase that I put out eight months ago, and then you just go with that hoe. Why won't you go with me? I don't need that question answered. I need it right now, 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 right now.